Hello there, my beautiful soul fans. My name is Catalina, and welcome back to my channel, Moonlight Awakening. And yes, I do angel readings. I connect directly with your team of angels using my beautiful and amazing angel deck. It just, people love the deck also, how it shows like a story and just the imagery, and it, it's just beautiful. And not only that, I'm a highly intuitive spiritual awakening coach. I've been this journey for a while. You know, you're experiencing all these things. You want to talk to somebody about it, right? And I'm here for you, you know, telling you, you know, technically we're not really alone, okay? But if you need someone, I'm right here, okay? And also, I make stone jewelry. I have an Etsy shop. And I'm wearing them right now. One of my earrings. And yes, so... I wasn't sure if I wanted to in show this on Facebook live because if you didn't know I have a Facebook and Instagram and on Facebook is the only one that I got live and and I was thinking should I do it there should I put it here on on YouTube I was like you know what I think I put it on my channel right here and on YouTube you know for anyone that's interested and no, I'm not the only one that has a con uh, collection of feathers. I have seen, um, you know, other people in social media or any things like that, that, hey, you know, they collect feathers, that's cool, you know, and they will have like a big box full of really neat feathers. So I don't know if that's why it made me collect feathers or I don't really know. But anyway, I am. <laughs> okay, so and maybe hey, maybe you want to start collecting your own special significant feathers, okay? And of course, um, I wanted to if you haven't seen my other video, white feather meanings, and ever since I did that video also for white feather meanings, like two uh, two days later, I really wanted to show off my feather collection i was like you know what this be really really neat to talk to you about my feather collection you know and that's why i just it just i was really excited to make this video okay this is why i'm here okay so so i so here it is the the white one the white little feathers these are the ones that they were constantly in my car like on my hood like almost single day will be on my hood oh not only that they'll be tapping my glass window i could be like driving and you'll be feathers like tapping my window to get my attention i'll be in the road like literally this type of feathers and i i decided to you know what i've been seeing all these feathers on my hood of my car you know i will just see one and I, obviously I will, I will thank Spirit, my beautiful angelic team. Thank you for your beautiful sign. You know, that I appreciate it, that I acknowledging them. And, you know, they will continue doing it, you know. And so I decided at least, call, I, I will at least collect one, right? So I did. Okay, so if you haven't seen that video yet, why feather meanings? If you really want to know the complete story um in my story also then i'll put the video um uh, down below this video the link for it okay so there you go so then i keep seeing white butterflies now awesome thank you <laughs> remember when spirit is around you okay so my next feather this is same gray and black one the, when you see a red, no, red, gray and, and white one means that, you know, to keep faith, you know, to stay strong because at the end, there's, there's a new dawn for you that, you know, that the road ahead is way much better, that is full of, you know, more, more uplifting. Maybe right now hasn't been the greatest for you right now, but, you know, it's, it's gonna get, it's gonna get better and I'm prime and i promise you it is it will get so much better and my story of this one that i was i knew 
something was gonna happen and I wasn't it that is you know it just hmm I was gonna deal with something really hard but I, I wasn't sure how how much it was gonna affect me I, I just I, I didn't know you know and you know when it comes it will come you know but I knew something was coming that it will be unpleasant <laughs> I don't know on what level so anyway I went to the park to my favorite park I take a bunch of pictures by the way um, <clears throat> you probably know which one it is if you've been following me on Facebook or Instagram and I post videos there too um, and they were sh and I barely arrived at the park barely I parked and then I turned my head and this feather was a few feet away from me and this feather was spinning like this down like that I was like I kept looking at it and looking at it until it fell down I was like huh so you know what and I wanted and I decided to pick it up so I picked it up and that's what was telling me that remember there's a new dawn there's positive the road ahead is so much better than they maybe right now is not the greatest right now or what's gonna come but later on it will it's gonna get so much better you know and they're telling you that and because i was there in that mind in that space oh i'm getting young that i was in that space you know not knowing little concerning uh, you know but there's a road there's a way better road up ahead way better and that's why it came to me and I was like, oh, thank you. And I just gave me chills just saying it because to confirm, yeah. <laughs> so, so that's why I love, love this feather. Okay. And I have another two more. Okay. I don't have a crazy collection. Um, okay. So the other one, I'm going to show this. It's the, the, the last two. They're pretty huge. More pretty big though or whatever so anyway so this is the other one I saw this again in my favorite park that I love going to and I was like what the heck is this what is this I have maybe you guys seen it maybe constantly you see this type of animal some type of birds first of all I have never seen one and this is very rarely common like I have never seen this type of feather so for me that was really rare I was like wait a second you know what and there's another feather right next to this that I'm gonna show you next okay so anyway and I found this really interesting but you know what I've never seen this feather it is huge it's pretty I just I just get it you know I don't know I, I didn't think much of it so I just picked it up and took it home and as well as the other feather I'm gonna show you but yeah this is an owl feather and it came to me in a meditation when I was meditating it came to me hey look look for those meanings of this feather and then the other feather I'm gonna show you look for those meanings I was like right 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 so when my meditation was over I I looked it up and I I couldn't believe the meaning it was it was so spot on what I was going through again it happened all at the in the same month in the same month that that the the last feather that was flying around like that and then later on then they showed then the spirit showed me this feather to look it up because there's something for you you need to know right so anyway okay i went with that and it's actually an owl feather i'm pretty sure some of you already know that and i did not know that okay i didn't know that i live in the desert um, I know there's owls in the desert, but not where I not there's there's not leaving some in my around my um, neighborhood. Sorry about the wind and the breeze. So this one, an owl feather, it means you know wisdom that I was gonna receive more wisdom that maybe I already received more wisdom, right? And not only that, saying that big, huge changes are coming your way oh yeah there are big changes are coming your way also calls intuition too and oh uh, yeah and me and me being highly in tune intuitive yeah definitely like mix why this feather this owl feather came into my life okay and not only that seeing beyond what of 
what you know like seeing beyond the veil seeing beyond you know that what other people don't see like for example like seeing behind the mask that other people don't see but you can see isn't that awesome and it also represents death that yeah it could be like literally like it could be that yeah maybe there's a that someone that you know uh they you know they're gonna it's time for the, their souls to leave to go you know um and that or it can also mean like change you know that life transitioning you're being transitioned for for something you know life transitioning of course you know you're shifting you're shifting to a different you know dimension you're shifting to um higher dimensions and and those are very uncomfortable because you're you're shifting that neg negative the dark to be able to shift to those more higher frequencies okay so anyway and and for me it was both it was both i lost someone extremely close to me and again everything I, any everything that represents this feather i was going through it everything not just actual a death of someone i know but also something within me as well it just changed a lot of things and and i i just i'm just blown away how spirit how the universe will show things to you that they're not such thing as coincidences and i guess so many confirmation like mm -mm, no such thing you know when you're spiritual awakening for a while you know you start noticing all this things that you never experienced before right and spirit will show you signs not just in numbers other ways too and that's why uh, i'm getting yeah so that our be will start becoming very meaningful to you so yeah here's a feather and i made a video last year um 2019 where where i explained my story how you know signs of deceased loved one i made two videos part one and part two if you want to see it and i also i asked our angel michael i was going through a lot of like dark spaces right there you can see how i change how i transform how i leveled up in my life by you know by telling you my experiences right the what i've been doing so and i asked our angel michael what do you want to say to anyone that has lost someone in their life you know and he gave such a it was just one card that explains it all i was like it was the last thing i was thinking of oh yeah and it just brought me tears obviously i'm a water sign emotional <laughs> okay as you know so yeah i'm gonna leave those two videos below watch part one and part two how it came to be I, i'm not you know i I didn't make it for you to feel sad about me it's just for you to like seeing how when you're going through things during your spiritual awakening how you can transform and evolve from that darkness you know you have to notice it to be able to shine the light upon it okay so yeah so anyway my next one is i just i just i got two actually and okay it's a little windy i don't want them to fly off okay so this is a peacock feather because and and then i have a bigger one look at that i have a tinier one too and and i gave one for my sisters too my mother sister she, i gave her a little one too and it has a little eye as well isn't that beautiful uh, I just love it and again the park I go to there's literally peacocks there and and these and these two were together a few feet away these two I was just looking in the ground thinking of hey maybe maybe I'll find something on the ground I don't, I don't know I don't know what I was thinking of that or maybe I'll find something cool maybe a cool feather I don't know it just came to me and I find these two together you know and so anyway the peacock feather and i keep it in my little cup right here my little cup in top of my bookcase but yeah 
the the peacock feather what it means what it represents it just it call, presents you know beauty balance the third eye see that how it looks like an eye you know immortality spirituality and uh, it just like and like leadership self-love awakening self-confidence and and of course resurrection I guess resurrection meaning that okay we know you're gonna lose someone in your life right death but we're saying that they're they're not completely gone our family members they're not completely gone oh I'm getting yeah they're right with you closer than to you than they can even imagine okay and and that's why the feather came to me too that only because they're gone they're well in this earth doesn't mean they're fully gone they're in the spirit realm now you know and, and the soul doesn't die at all you know it, it's gonna continue living and resurrection meaning our cycle of life you know we come to this earth um and then we came here for you know earth experiences right and we resurrect again and we go through cycles again and again we, like us we're assigned a resurrection right here you know i have lived i'm a very old soul so i have come you know again with my wisdom unlocking my wisdom and all of us you all have your wisdom okay we come here to unlock those wisdoms from other lifetimes how many times you have incarnated so imagine that oh so i made a confirmation it's like yes see so that's my feather collection that i keep in this beautiful cup did i say that it's in top of my bookcase i'll keep it right on top of my bookcase i don't know if i said that or not so yeah hopefully this gives you i don't know hopefully it makes you want to collect your own feathers too you know when when that if you haven't received your wife your feathers yet oh you will it, like you will something is just going to you will know you will know okay maybe you want to start collecting your beautiful special feathers and put them in somewhere special to you okay so yeah like and subscribe for more you know videos to help in your spiritual awakening journey and yeah and until next time bye